Hello, Linda from Bar Lady's Body Blitz and Little Mini eating some snackies. Today we're going to do a mat abs workout. 10 minutes is all we've got. We're going to just use our body weight, but if you want to intensify, add some light ankle weights and you can even hold on to some light hand weights if you wanted to, or a resistance loop, that's another option. We're gonna get straight into it. Today I want you to sit really nice and tall and then cross one leg over, okay, like this, as if you're about to do one of those stretches. This is the position we're going to start in. I want you to anchor your, your ankle against the back of that knee. Deep breath in and then blow all the air out and start to curve forward as if you're trying to curve your chest forward. Imagine you're holding on and then let that air out and curve forward. From here, we're just going to come back. So push all the way back. So you're pushing as if someone's poking you in the belly button and pushing you. So you're coming, blowing out all that air, coming back and back. Long arms here, and if this is too much for you, you can come further up. The further up you are, the easier it's gonna be. But remember, 10 minutes is all we've got. Really anchor that leg in against the back of that knee for four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna come up and down. We're just gonna hold this position. Up and down, up and down with that arm. So really think about blowing out as the arm comes up for four, three, two, one. Now other arm looking straight ahead, up and down. Come on, up and down. You're holding everything, it's isometric tension for four. Three, two, one. Guess what? Alternating bigger. Up and down. Up and down. Breathe through it. Breathe through it. Come on, you can do it. For four, three, two, and one. Come up for a second. Deep breath in. C curve and back down. We're going to extend the leg now. We're gonna put our hands behind our ears and we're gonna rotate and bring that knee in. Extend and bend. Twist. Twist. So I am tapping my knee to my elbow each time. Not many, because I know it's tough. Four, three, two, one, now anchor it again, and we're just gonna come up with the elbow. Twist and tap and back down. Twist and tap and back down. If you anchor that ankle in behind your knee, it makes it easier. Let's go three, two, so fiery, and one. Put your hands down, tummies are in. We're gonna switch it up. Switch it up. So bend, extend, changing the leg that's on top. Extend, extend. Now, if you want to, bring your chest towards your knees and blow out. As you come up, blow out the air. Crunching, crunching. Now, if you want to, take your hands off. Not many more for four and three, and two, and one, and you're gonna end up with your other leg on top. See how fast this is? We're gonna, I'm just gonna switch sides so you can see better. So once again, anchor your ankle behind the knee, deep breath in. Sink back, C curve your chest forward, hold on for a second. You are facing in line with that knee and that foot. Okay, so keep it really nice and straight. From here, arms in front, blow out all the air and push back as if someone's pushing you in the belly button. Push back, push back. I'm just repeating that. Six, five, blow out as you push back. Three, two, one. Now up and down with that front arm. Holding that position. So think 
Blow out as your arm comes up. Blow out as your arm comes up. So as you blow out, contract a little bit more through the abs. Three, two, one. And now back arm, up and down. Remember, you can be higher up. Holding this position is such fire. If you're low like me and you're really pushing C-curving forward, go for four, three, two. Minis eating way too many snacks. One. Guess what? We're going to alternate our arms. Alternate. Make it look pretty floating through the air. Up and down, up and down. If you need to be higher, Come on, I get it, it's hurting now. And down for four, three, two, and one. Oh my goodness. Deep breath in, we're going to come back down and we're gonna extend the leg and we're gonna twist. Extend and twist. So you're coming in, tapping that elbow to knee, twist, and twist. Oh my goodness, the pain for four and three and two and one. Now anchor it again and you're just tapping, coming back and up and tap. Come back center, up and twist, twist, twist. Come on, we're nearly there. Five, four, three. Two, one, come back, hands are back down, come on, we can do this. Just switch, and switch, and switch. Blow out as the knees come in, and switch, and switch. Come on, if you want to, take your hands off for four, three, two, and one, now, lay all the way down. Bring your legs up, cross the leg over. Hand behind your head. All we're gonna start with is down and up. If you don't want to lift your shoulders here, lay all the way down. But if you want to lift the shoulders, think press your spine against the mat for four and three, and two, and one. Now anchor your front arm. We're gonna come down and then across with that back elbow. Blow out all the air. If you need to bend your back leg, you can do that. And across, and across. I know it's tough. If you can't come all the way to the floor like me with that straight leg, Maybe just a little way, like this. And three. And two. And one. Now bend that leg, reach. Reach towards it. Support your head in your hand. Directly reaching. You're pivoting your hips. Blowing all the air out and reach. Can you touch your foot? Reach. Six. Five. Four, three, two, one. Come back to straight. We're gonna come down, up, and switch. Up, and switch. Up, and switch. Switch, come on. Back is drilling into the mat. And switch, just four more. Three. Two, one, and we're back. Just up and down. Lift your shoulders if you want, up and down. Or here, down here. Or maybe you're just here, and that's fine too. We're nearly done. Up and down, up and down. Four, three, two, one. Anchor your back hand as it comes up, twist. Twist, blow all the air out. Twist, twist, or maybe you're here. Or maybe you're here. That's fine too. It's hard, I know, four, 
three, two, one. Bend and twist towards the back. So you're twisting your hips, you're touching with the back hand, reaching diagonal side, tapping your foot each time if you can. So you're trying to crunch the side body, hips to ribs on the back side there. Twist, twist, come on. Eight, seven, six, we're nearly done. Five, four, three, two, and one. Come back up, come out, and down. Wide open and down cross. Wide open, down cross. Wide open, down cross. Come on, last thing. Bonus inner thigh stretch. And down, and out, and down. You're going wide here. For four. Three. Two. One, come up and finish up here. Now very, very slowly, you can put your head down. Very, very slowly. Push your spine into the mat, very, very slowly. We're dropping those legs. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And you're done, you're done guys. Oh my goodness, maybe lay on your front and just push up, some deep breaths here. So how did you like that? Short and sharp, 10 minutes is all we had. Maybe I went a little bit over time. Lots of twisting action, that new um, leg across the other leg. I don't think I've done that before in any of my workouts, so you're welcome. Definitely gets those abs and especially those obliques, the waistline in a new way. So hope you enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing you again very soon. Bye for now.